Hello everybody, my name is Kaya and today I'm about to start a hot girl summer transformation because it's not over yet, okay? Technically, summer's not over until September, so I don't know why everybody's talking about Halloween. It's not even summer. And for those of us who are summer babies, like moi, my birthday is in two days. It's offensive, so. I'm about to start a transformation though. Um, I wanted to document to you my nails. I'm about to get my nails done. I'm about to go do my nails, but I'm going to do that in a separate video because you don't want to see that. You want to see the whole transformation. That's the point of this one. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Okay, so I'm about to go get my nails done. Here's the before. They're awful. I don't want to talk about it. I have a problem. I bite my nails. All right, so here is the finished result of my nails. They are black holographic sparkle. Um, they're pretty cute and pointy. I love them. And I should have thought this through, but the next step is to get this color out of my hair. So. See, I start with my roots because they're the darkest, so I'm trying to get that dark color out first. Wow, I left out a whole chunk right here. Remind me to never do two packs at once again because it's overflowing out of the bowl. like the whole waiting game with this. My camera's gonna die because I can't change it because it has to fall over my hands, unfortunately. Oh my. It burns like a mother. It doesn't burn, it just itches. Oh, it's itching. She's itchy right now. But I am like a pro at this, so the nails aren't gonna phase me. I will see you whenever I'm done with my hair because my battery's dying and I can't, I can't change it right now, okay? All right guys, so we're almost done with the transformation. I just am going to do my makeup last and we're gonna start with primer. I figured I'm going to just talk to you guys while I do this part because it's gonna be harder than normal to do this. It's like nothing on that squirt because I have these paws and i haven't had nails and it oh i go up to my neck i did it did maybe i just can't see what i'm doing i hope you saw that we're gonna move on i love primer that's probably 
one of the most important steps that I used to overlook as a child. So if I ever do like a how I did my makeup back in the day and I use primer, you should roast me, okay? Because I used to not I used to not. Period. Dark dark the end. That's it. No. Nope. But this is one of my favorite things now. Oh yeah. Sorry, I had to air them out. So I don't have a mirror. <laughs> I always do this to myself, but you know what? I don't think there's a mirror in the palette that I'm gonna be using today. So we're gonna be using the Alien palette. We love her so much. So first things first, I'm just gonna go ahead and put this brow gel thingy in my brows. It's just from Benefit and it's like a light brown color. Some might say dirty blonde, you know. So next I'm going to go ahead and put some concealer onto my eyelids because today's look might involve some light colors. I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to be doing today. I just know what I'm going to be doing. I'm trying to be careful because these claws could dip into any pan and damage it, you know. We don't want that. We just want maximum coverage. I know what you're thinking. Why did you do three layers? Because I feel like I'm not getting anything out because of Epic Pan. So I'm like, you know, trying to get whatever I can out of there. So you caught me. I haven't brushed my makeup brushes. Like they didn't make sense. I haven't cleaned my makeup brushes since, it's probably been at least two times since the last time I've cleaned it. So maybe more. We're gonna move on. So I'm gonna be taking the colors Abduction, which is this very, very light green right there in the corner. So I'm gonna be taking Abduction and it's gonna be that one right there in the corner and I'm gonna be placing it all over my eyelid. We're gonna do a second layer just because I think that, think that I should add it to a pretty light color. Now that is going to be the base coat for this whole look. So I'm gonna go ahead and do the same thing on the other side. Okay, so now that I've got all of that green packed on, I'm about to take Pluto, which is in the top left corner. And I'm gonna be placing Pluto in my brow bone. I'm gonna go ahead and get that important step out of the way so we don't forget about it later when it gets intense. I don't really know where I'm going with this. I have a plan, kind of, but now I'm gonna be taking tall gray, which is this color right here. And I'm going to be placing it in my crease. And I'm going to take a little bit of the Ghost OG and put it a little bit more into the crease. This is the Ghost OG. So now I'm about to take Alien and I'm about to put it all over my eyelid. Kinda. Perfect, now I'm gonna do the same thing off camera to the other side so that we can hurry this up. So I decided I'm gonna go ahead and do my face makeup because I'm gonna save the hardest part for last, which is gonna be my lashes and my eyeliner because of these nails. Now I did my hair just fine. So I could do my lashes just fine, but you know, you never know. You never know. It's really hard to hold this without stabbing myself in the face. You guys got any tricks? There's no flip in this piercing upper. Maybe I can hold her. I'll go around her. Seriously, how do you guys apply your foundation? I wanna know, do you do exactly how I do it? Or do, like, do you put it on your hand first? What do you do? 
I want to know. I don't want to. I don't want to look stupid. Okay. I want you to be honest with me and tell me how you do it. But only specifically if you use the Maybelline Fit Me. Because listen, listen, it's a we or like one like this that like we just gotta like pour that shit out. You know what I mean? Because if you got a little applicator brush, don't you come for me saying, oh, I just put it on my face like you do. Okay, well that's different. I'm putting a glob of that shit on. I'm trying to blend it in where I can. Make sure I put enough, but not too much, because if you put too much and then she looks. You like how I'm hiding my hair from you? Meet my bonnet. She's been through it, and we're not gonna talk about it. My dog has been chewing on it, so there's some, there's a hole there. We're gonna blur that out, hopefully. If not, then you saw a little sneak peek. I'm probably not gonna blur it out because honestly, I'm being lazy right now. I'm not gonna blur it out. Give me a little sneak peek about what my hair is gonna look like in about five minutes when I'm done with my makeup, so. You guys, I woke up at six o'clock today. What the fuck? My birthday is tomorrow. My 21st birthday is tomorrow. Oh my gosh. Can I be honest with you? I have no plans. <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna do anything. So, that's not sad. It's not sad. I'm gonna have a blast with my dogs, but I don't plan on really doing anything, unfortunately. Which is fine by me, but usually, like, my birthdays are a big deal. And ever since I turned 18, they just suck ass. It's up to me to, like, make them good, you know, but, like, <laughs> I don't. I don't. I just don't. You already know concealer. Ooh. Yeah. You like that? So I'm trying not to go super fast because if I mess up here I can cover up my makeup. But I'm trying not to go super slow. Because who wants to deal with a one like person, you know what I mean? If you go slow, I can't. I can't. I'm a very fast paced person. When I'm in the store, I'd be walking crazy fast. I have to like slam on the brakes pretty much when I'm walking because people like will cut me off. <laughs> Acting like I'm driving. What? No, but I'm being serious. Like if I'm driving, like walking down the aisle, say for example, the grocery store, I'll be like, Ch -ch -ch with my shopping cart and like I have to like with my cart because <laughs> somebody wants to cut me off but I do be going really fast so but I do go pretty fast so So I'm going to be contouring with Hula and Hula Light. This is highlight, so I'm using the cream one that's in here, I'm trying to get it out with my finger without doing that. Well, the damage has already been done. There's nothing that I can do now. How do you, how do you barely do this? Okay, that now might work better. Right over the powder too. Mm -hmm. No taking it off. Oh my god, I just stained it. There you go, took it off. Oh my goodness. You guys, I'm even, I'm, I can't talk. I'm nervous. 
I turned 21 in like less than 12 hours. And if I'm quite honest with you, I wish I could sit here and be like, and here's what I'm happy about. Here's what I'm, you know, grateful for. But if I'm being real and raw with you, these past three years being an adult have been hell. Like, you know, you know, you know what happened. Everybody dealt with it. And to anyone who was also freshly an adult and that struck and you had to deal with your first few years of adulthood with, you know, being locked inside of your own house, I feel your pain. And to everybody who, you know, had to go from living normal lives to living into their house just like everybody else feel your pain too sucks because i figured i would be somewhere else by now but it's okay that's okay i'll get there eventually eventually i'm about to take a little knife and contour my nose My skin is like so dead on my nose. So if you like get up close to my nose, you can see all the cracks. Which you're not gonna get up close to my nose, so you won't see the cracks, which is great. Great for me. So the next step before I have to get serious is my lip gloss. This is Coroner's Kiss by, you know, Jeffrey Stone. Okay, so I'm about to get like right here and do my eyeliner. I'm just giving you a heads up. I'm gonna do it. You speed it up and I'll be right back. I disappeared. I can't tell if it looks good. How do they look? Awful. Thanks. Good. Kinda good. I'll be back. I'm gonna do my lashes off camera and then I'm gonna do a giant reveal for you guys just because my liner already isn't working out, so I'm not going to get frustrated in front of you guys. I'm going to keep this all cute for you. I'll be right back, okay? So, she's still wet, and she's just so blonde, and I'm so, so, so happy with it. I, I think that I successfully have transformed myself and gotten ready for my birthday tonight. Um, if you didn't know, when the clock strikes midnight tonight, I'll be 21. So, happy birthday to me. And yeah, tomorrow I have a special birthday surprise for you guys because if you know me at all, you know this isn't where I stop. I'm about to color my fucking hair. And so if you guys enjoyed this, stay tuned for tomorrow's video because you'll see what color I dye my hair. Thank you guys again for watching. Stay right. Don't get abducted by aliens because that doesn't sound like fun. Okay? And have a great day, guys. Bye.